just to show that uh, there's lots of ways to uh, create a design uh, that'll work for the uh, Tark Echelon F. Uh, and since our PLA 3D printer is down with the thermistor that's out and we don't have the part yet, we're going to go back to some um, basic uh, model rocketing skills and make a body tube uh, adapter that's going to fit the fin can by taking two toilet paper rolls, uh, cutting them lengthwise, and then wrapping them around the BT-70 body tube exterior. This will make an exterior fin can that will be double walled and will attach the uh, hobby plywood fins to that. That will just slide up and that will be again a removable fin can with uh, cap screws. Be six of those that will uh, secure that. The engine mount, as a previous uh, design, will be a BT-70 uh, engine mount and will replace the 24 millimeter tube that we've got on the two uh, lower cores that we've already built, which is a BT-60 and a BT-55. Um, no, only the BT-55 has a 24 millimeter. Uh, we're going to the 29 millimeter uh, body tube motor mount uh, to use the larger of the F engines. Uh, even though we don't need them, uh, certainly going to be down in the lower class uh, engine classes, E's and F's in thrust. Probably run, we need about 40 newtons of uh, total impulse, which is the area under the curve of the, uh, the impulse curve, thrust curve. That averages out at uh, typically 35, 30 to 35 newtons. Um, maximum of 40 some newtons and then it peters off in about one second to uh, 10 newtons or less and uh, so we think we got a good plan for uh, being able to get this uh, put together tonight and if we're lucky we'll be able to launch tomorrow at Great Meadows for our first test flight. <laughs>